Hey guys, Boba Bricks here with another video, and today what I have for you guys is a LEGO Avengers Endgame Set Leaks update video. You guys have enjoyed the last Avengers Endgame Set Leaks video so much that I thought I would do an update video to this, and this has been made possible by the Instagram user FalconFan1414, which there will be a slide for him at the end and a link in the description that will lead to the website with that goes further in depth into this information as well as a link to Falcon fans Instagram but without further ado let's get into this now starting off with our first set the set number is 76123 and we're apparently but gonna be getting a Captain America attack of the Outrider which will be $20 with 167 pieces and I'm guessing that this one will probably just be a Jeep like I mentioned in the last video uh, probably a Captain America main figure, or we're gonna be getting the Captain America main figure if this set turns out to be legit with the Outrider and possibly probably another superhero main figure like Black Widow or Ronin or someone like that. But I'm guessing, like I said, just a little Jeep, maybe a little side build next to it, but nothing too big. And this does make it sound like the Outriders will be coming back for Avengers Endgame. Now for our next set, we have 76124 War Machine Crusher, which will be $30 with 362 pieces. I'm not sure what this one could be. Some people have mentioned that it could possibly be a War Machine Hulkbuster-like build. I'm not sure, but it could also be a tank like I was thinking in the previous video. I'll leave a link to that in the end of this video. But I'm not sure about that, we'll just see a way and see. But the piece count and price do match up pretty well, and the set numbers that I had mentioned in the last slide actually do match up really well with the Marvel line with the set numbers that we've been getting lately. So we'll see if that ends up to be um, true or not with these set numbers. Like I said, this is not official at all, this is just um, some leaks that have been going around on the internet. So. They could actually be from, someone could have actually seen this from LEGO, or someone could have just come up with this. But from this information, it seems pretty legit. So now with our next slide, we're going to be getting a Iron Man armor room that will be $60 with 524 pieces. And the set number will be 76125. Now this set, I'm guessing, will probably have to do something with Pepper Potts with her rescue suit armor that we have seen uh, like set images from that I think the actor Gwent Patro has posted on her Instagram I believe with pictures of her in the purple rescue suit armor so it'd be pretty cool to get a couple Iron Man suits and pepper pots in that armor probably in Iron Man's armor in which the closest we ever got to that was in the Iron Man Malibu Mansion attack back in uh, I don't even know maybe 2013 that was I'm not sure but this set does sound pretty cool. And the piece count, although, is a little overpriced for the 524 pieces. This is kind of a Star Wars set price. But it is what it is, and we'll just see how it ends up going. Our next set, we're going to be getting a Avengers Super Quinjet, which it will be $8 with 832 pieces. And this one sounds pretty interesting. It could be a Quinjet that will bring the Avengers to the Quantum Realm or something of that sort. I don't know. But I've seen that um, rumors and people thinking that it could possibly be that, which would be pretty cool. And so this one for the piece count is actually not bad, especially considering the price of many of these other sets with $8 for 832 pieces. But this set I'm thinking will probably come with a couple characters, maybe such as Thor and Bruce Banner and War, or not War Machine most likely. I'm not sure, just a couple heroes and probably maybe Outriders or whatever the other villain is going to be in Avengers Endgame. But we'll see about that one. Now with our next set, we'll begin a 7-6-1-3-1 through one Battle of the Assembled Avengers, which is supposedly going to be $100 with 699 pieces. And this does match up with the Avengers location set that I have in my previous video. And the piece count still does seem really overpriced for this $100 price point. But we'll see about this. I'm not sure. But I'm guessing that this one will probably have a bunch of the Avengers all together, and this will probably be that set that will include Thanos, since LEGO seems to like to put Thanos in the more expensive sets, but we'll see. And especially considering that's the Battle of the Assembled Avengers, this one does sound like it will be kind of a final battle set, which does sound pretty cool, and we'll see how this one turns out. 
Now, this has been made possible by FalconFan1414 on Instagram. Make sure to check him out. There will be a link to a website in the description which has a link to his Instagram. So, um, make sure to click on that and so the website goes into further depth with this information. So, if you guys want to look into a little bit more into this, I would definitely suggest going there. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram, Evo Reverts. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.